Well, today we'd like to explain a little bit about our clear materials. We get a lot of questions about the differences between uh, Somos Watershed resin versus Acura 60. And the reason we get these questions is because they're in two different machines with different capabilities. So what we'd like to do is demonstrate the differences in both the materials with three different custom finish options. In this first option you'll see this is our natural clear finish. This is basically a part that has been taken straight out of the machine. It's as built and you'll notice you can see some of the build layering as the machine produced the part. So this is sort of a raw finish and we call this natural clear. This is ideal for someone who needs a part quickly with no post-processing and is also mindful of, of cost and possibly timing. Then we move over here to standard finish. These parts have been sanded, they've been, all the support marks have been removed, the parts have been sanded to a roughly a 220 grit, and they've been put through a process of either water honing or media blasting to remove any surface imperfections. This part here would be ideal for someone who needs a smooth finish, maybe for just a functional part. And then our final example is the same materials, but they've been uh, put through a post-processing of clear coat. Now the clear coat is a professional grade paint system that we use in our paint booth. And what the clear coat option does is enhances the clarity of the part. It makes the part smooth. It could be for the purpose of a water absorption barrier. And it also has a UV uh, protection in that clear coat as well, just like it would on your car. So when you're talking about differences in transpar uh, transparency, you'll notice with a natural clear part, you can still see through it a little bit, but there's some haziness to it. You can still see the build lines. With a standard finished part, you cannot see through it. It's, it's hazy, it's foggy, completely opaque. And then with the clear coat part, you can definitely see that we've optimized the clarity of these materials. Now in terms of differences between these two materials, between Watershed in my hand, my mm -hmm. left hand, and Acura 60, there is a slight color tint difference. So most Watershed is a little more blue, whereas Acura 60 might have a slight yellowish tinge to it. Other than that, they're pretty close, and they are good substitutes for each other when they're maybe neither not available. So if you have any questions, feel free to contact one of our client success managers, and we'll be able to help you out from there. Thanks.